Hey, what's going on you guys? I'm TJ Harmon. Thanks for joining me for week 8 of my 2013-2014 NFL season. Here are my week 8 picks. Thursday Night Football is the Carolina Panthers at the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Panthers three straight wins. They'll make it four as they beat the Buccaneers in Tampa Bay. Sunday games is the Buffalo Bills at the New Orleans Saints. Saints coming off their bye. Bills winners over the Dolphins in the come from behind game. Saints easily will beat the Bills in this one at the Superdome. The Miami Dolphins are at the New England Patriots in the AFC Division game. Dolphins tight loss to the Bills. Patriots unbelievable loss to the Jets. So they split that series between each other. But the Patriots will rebound Tom Brady and company. I think he'll pass for a big four touchdowns and beat the Dolphins at New England. The New York Giants are at the Philadelphia Eagles. Eagles did not show up for that game against the Cowboys last week. I mean, that game was a sleeper, but they couldn't do anything. Nick Foles suffered a concussion. Watch when I tell you. Matt Barkley, I don't think the Eagles don't have confidence in him. He threw three interceptions in the fourth quarter alone. The Giants coming off their first win of the season against the Minnesota Vikings. I don't know why I didn't pick them late Monday like I told y'all. I'm going to go with the Eagles to sweep the Giants at the link for the season series. The Dallas Cowboys at the Detroit Lions. Cowboys showed up but didn't play their best against the Eagles. And I don't think they're going to show up with the Lions either. Dominic and Sue will give Romo hell. And Matthew Stafford may throw two, three touchdown passes to Megatron. And the Lions, I got to beat the Cowboys in Detroit. The San Francisco 49ers and the Jacksonville Jaguars will be in London at Wembley Stadium for the final game of the International Series. 49ers, I'm definitely going to have to beat the Jaguars, but will the Jaguars make that point spread? Find out. 49ers will be the winners against Jacksonville. Cleveland Browns are at the Kansas City Chiefs. Chiefs, the only undefeated team in the NFL, going to go with 8-0 and beat the Browns. However, Jason Campbell will get the call for the Browns as Brandon Whedon was not given the okay to start for Cleveland. The New York Jets are at the Cincinnati Bengals. Jets just getting lucky in week one with a field goal with Folk, and Folk did it again against the Patriots. Not going to see that again. Andy Dalton and company will make sure of that. And I will make sure that the Bengals beat the Jets in Cincinnati on the late game on Sunday afternoon. The Pittsburgh Steelers at the Oakland Raiders. Raiders coming off their bye. Terrell Pryor is likely going to be playing in that one and might give the Steelers some hell. We'll have to wait and see. But I think Ben Roethlisberger and LaVon Bell who will make this one count. Steelers win their third straight and beat the Raiders in Oakland. The Washington Redskins are at the Denver Broncos. Redskins win a shootout against the Bears. And Denver, I don't know, they really gave that win to the Indianapolis Colts last Sunday or whatever. But I think Peyton Manning will rebound from that loss and beat up on the Redskins as if it was nothing else that they could possibly do. Uh, Peyton Manning did not practice the last few days and I don't think he's going to practice this week. Maybe start for the, the Broncos. We have to wait and see. Whatever the difference may be, Broncos will be the winners. The Atlanta Falcons at the Arizona Cardinals. Falcons coming off that bye after beating up on the Ember Bay Buccaneers. The Cardinals couldn't do anything with Seattle. I don't think they're going to do anything with the Falcons. Uh, Steven Jackson may likely play for the Falcons this week after being injured. We'll have to wait and see, but the Falcons will beat the Cardinals at any rate and Glendale. Sunday Night Football, the Green Bay Packers at the Minnesota Vikings. Aaron Rodgers and company on a rebound after a big win last week. Two straight wins for the Packers. Vikings, I don't know what else to say. They're going to be 1-6, and six, and this is a lot of distraction with this Josh Freeman being a quarterback, but he suffered a concussion against the Giants, so he's not even going to start. Christian Ponder probably will start for Minnesota. It's not going to make a difference. Packers will beat the Vikings. On Monday Night Football, Seattle Seahawks at the St. Louis Rams. Seahawks just too powerful right now in another NFC division game. 
Seahawks on the road to beat the Rams in St. Louis on Monday Night Football. Teams with buys this week, we got the Baltimore Ravens, the Tennessee Titans, the Chicago Bears, San Diego Chargers, the Houston Texans, and the Indianapolis Colts. Those are my Week 8 picks. What are yours? Post them at the bottom. We'll see you back here next week for Week 9, and hopefully I'll be over 508 straight weeks. Thanks for watching. I'll see you down the road.